testing. This is a brown recluse, the most venomous spider in the U.S. While you probably don't want to see one in your home, here at the North Carolina Museum of Natural Sciences, you can take a look from a safe distance. I still get scared by them. <laughs> On Thursday, seven-year-old Louis Jenkins and his parents got a sneak peek at the museum's newest exhibit, Spiders, Fear to Fascination. He has always loved nature, and even if it creeps him out a little bit, he uh, he's fascinated by it. It's the first museum in the country to host this traveling exhibit. I've worked here for over 20 years. This is my favorite exhibit. The museum's chief veterinarian says spiders are a key part of nature. Some folks are not, uh, they're a little bit afraid of spiders, maybe, so this is a good chance to come in and really learn about them and, and hopefully gain a new appreciation for spiders. You can even get up close and personal with spiders to see they're not as scary as some people might think. Visitors can walk with them, dance with them, and even see their drawing come to life. So when they see a spider in the lawn or, or on the wall in the house, it, instead of being afraid, you know, they'll they'll kind of have a new appreciation and, and maybe not uh, maybe not squish so many spiders. <laughs> it's a lesson Louie took home. They're as scared of you as you are scared of them. His mom agrees and says she's impressed with how interactive it is. If you're a little concerned about it, it might be a little scary. It is not. Um, everything is safely in its place. The exhibit is open to the general public starting this Saturday and runs through October 8th. Chloe Rafferty, CBS 17 News. Okay, I'm okay with spiders that are animated. I was going to say, not real spiders. And the other side of glass. Fake spiders. Good on that. <laughs>